Hello friends, in today's episode we answer some of your questions about growing avocados. So in this popular video on growing avocados that I had posted earlier, there were a lot of questions. And in today's episode, I'll try to answer some of those questions while giving you some more tips on growing great avocados in your garden. So the gem avocado tree starts flowering in the month of February. And a lot of you have asked one question which we're going to jump to right now. And that is where to find a gem avocado tree. As you can see here posted by Ronnie. Well, I bought my tree from a local farmer's market in Orange County. There is a farmer's market at the Great OC Park in Irvine. So if you're around this place, uh, you can buy it there. If not, check out your nurseries, your local nurseries, your garden centers. You might find this avocado tree. If not, you can find other dwarf avocado trees uh, that work uh, very well, that grow very well in your garden. So that's a another choice if you cannot find the gem avocado tree locally. Now let's move on to the next question. The user subgunman has posted a question whether you need a mating tree in order for the trees to produce or can a single tree produce fruit. Well it's a great question. And this gem avocado tree does not need any other tree to form fruits. It's a self-pollinating variety. So when you're buying your avocado tree, you need to check what kind of tree you are buying. Some avocado trees need pollinators, which means it needs flowers from another plant to produce fruit. But in this case, this gem avocado tree can produce fruits just by itself. Now moving on to the next question, uh, this question comes from Adalberto Dominguez and he had a question about pruning the trees. Now pruning your tree is a very important activity that you should be aware of. You should never prune the trees when the tree is flowering or fruiting. The best time to prune your avocado tree is in the month of, of January or February after the harvest you need to make sure that the tree doesn't have any fruits. Now you can prune the tree as you like, give it a nice shape, uh, make sure that the fruits are reachable, the tree doesn't get too tall. But if you're growing a dwarf tree, the tree should stay in shape. However, I do recommend that you prune your tree every year or at least every two years to remove the dead branches and give a nice shape to your tree. So while you watch uh, the gem avocados being harvested, let's move on to the next question which comes from Greg M. And he lives in southwestern Florida and was wondering if the weather is good for this uh, gem avocado variety. Well, the answer is yes. Florida usually has warmer weather than uh, Southern California from what I know. So the bottom line is as long as you have warm weather, you do not get a freeze outside. You can grow this plant outside. However, if you have severe winters or get a freeze, what do you do? Well, that brings us to our next question, which is posted by Peter Van Vick. And the question is, can you plant the gem avocado in a big pot and move it to shelter during the winters? Or will it withstand the cold? Well, this plant will not withstand any kind of cold or freeze. So if you are in an area which has severe winters, you experience a snow or freezing temps, you can grow this in a pot, a container, a large container. And then what you can do is you can get it indoors during the nights when it's freezing cold. But you do need to keep it outside because this plant still needs sunlight to grow. So that's an important part. And now moving on to the next question, which is a very important question. Uh, this comes from Hytran and a lot of you have also asked me the same question, whether growing avocado from seed is a good option and how long does it take to harvest when you grow it from seed? Well, let me tell you one thing. If you want fruits from your avocado tree, you have to buy a tree 
which is a grafted tree if you know how to do a graft you can do that by yourself you need a good rootstock and a good uh, tree that you can graft however for most people it's just easier to just go ahead and buy an avocado tree well if you plant an avocado tree uh, from seed or you try to grow it from seed there is no guarantee that you're going to get fruits in the tree it's like playing the lottery some people have planted a seed and got avocados from it some people have been waiting for 15 20 years for the fruit so do you really have the time to take that risk well if you're just growing for fun you know to show your kids how an avocado tree looks like yeah by all means go ahead and plant a seed an avocado seed and then try to grow a tree from that but if you really want good fruits uh, in your tree uh, you need to buy a grafted tree the next question comes from lemon tea 128 in terms of flavor do you prefer this or the has now this is a interesting question because this is something that i've been wanting to tell everyone this actually tastes very similar to the has avocado but it tastes a little better in my opinion it's got a little more nuttier taste and it just tastes a little better than the has avocado but it's very close to the taste so if you like has avocados you will love this avocado variety so there we have it folks i hope this answers some of your avocado growing questions and if you like these kind of q and a videos put in a comment below give us a thumbs up if you like this video and we'll see you again soon Happy gardening